Hey everyone, I'm in Subnautica. Here's a quick tutorial on the nuclear reactor. So when you find the blueprints for it, you can uh, build it in your base and it gives a serious amount of power when you add some nuclear uh, power rods to it, which is what we're going to do in a minute. Um, but I'm just going to talk about how you build it, what you need for it, um, and then I'll show you it in action. So if I have a little, little look at my habitat builder here, uh, once you've found the blueprints to it, um, here's the nuclear reactor and you can see it needs a plasteel ingot, advanced wiring kit and three lead. So um, not too difficult to build. Uh, when you build it, you'll need to put it in a pretty big room. So I've got this multi-purpose room here. So that is, um, and by this time, by the time you found that, you've probably found this as well. So big multi-purpose room, stick it in the middle there. Um, something to dispose of the wad, the wads. <laughs> I've gone, I've gone uh, lost my R's there. Sorry about that. <laughs> to dispose of the rods. Uh, in here uh, when they're spent but they do last a very long time I played most of the game uh, with the nuclear reactor active with four rods and I only just had to dispose of them right near the end of the game so what about the rods what do we need for it let's go and have a little look um, so if you go to your fabricator and then when you're on here uh, you'll find it under resources electronics and it's this thing here reactor rod so these are used to power nuclear reactors you need three uranite uh, crystals lead titanium and glass and when you've got all of those you can make one of these bad boys so the reactor rod um, now obviously this is um, radioactive so you want to have your radiation suit on so you know, get a load of radiation when you're doing this and then you can just pop over to your nuclear reactor press the A button here and then chuck this in and you'll see that we will then get some magical power du -du didn't that sound cool so when you do that, so it's just A and then added it to the right, um, but now you can see that the reactor is indeed active. So that is all good. So the more uh, rods you add to it, the more power you will receive. Um, so I've only put the one rod in at the minute um, and there it is there and it will power away. And if I want more power, more power, um, I just add that to it and all is good. So eventually what will happen, like I say, after quite a lot of game time, uh, the rod will be spent and when that happens you can take it out I think you can take it out beforehand if you want to press A to pull it out uh, and then you can dispose of it in this bad boy over here the nuclear waste disposal but that's it that's how the nuclear reactor works um, if you need to know how to get some of the components that make up the reactor or anything like that hit me up in the comments or have a little look at the rest of my tutorials I'm trying to add some tutorials to it um, to my playlist, um, even though the game is pretty old now, uh, I had some uh, a particular YouTuber, Stumpy West, asked me for some more help. Uh, he didn't actually ask for this one, or he or she, I don't know. Um, but I thought I would add this one anyway as I was looking at other stuff and my nuclear reactor was low. Hope that was useful to you. If it was, thumbs up, please. Any comments, welcome. And um, yeah, have a little look at the rest of my channel. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Thanks.